Hey, hey, what's up, y'all? It's Real Estate Latrice, also known as author, one unique writer. I am here to inspire you to aspire to go higher within without. So I have a chronicle that I am going to give you to help to build you up and build that faith and to prove to you how important it is that you go within without. So today's chronicle is called To Be or Not To Be a Leper. All right. Here we go. So what I know and realize and recognize in my own life and the lives of others is that the things we speak actually manifest. It was the year 2005 when the doctor diagnosed me with an incurable skin disease. Ultimately, I had surgery and multiple outbreaks after the surgery. There was pretty much nothing that could be done. The suffering increased at first because of my mental state. I think the pain was, I think the pain was more because, I think it was more than it actually was just because I kept thinking about the the bumps and, and lumps and cysts and, and the ooze that was exploding from my skin. But, um, you know, I became so devastated about it that I started saying, I don't have this. I do not care what the doctor says. I would say it even while I was having outbreaks. I prayed and refused to believe that I had a disease. It actually, though, I had to keep going through that, but it took months for the power of my words to manifest. But I guess I kept saying it so much that I actually started believing my own words. Now it has been well over 10 years and I've been outbreak and disease free since 2006. So with that being said, I don't care who says what, you need to be saying something different. If that person is not speaking healing, uh, healing, growth and prosperity, then you don't need to be listening to them. So just, you know, if you have a situation that seems impossible, according to the human beings on this earth, then talk to God and ask him to remove anything that is holding your prayers up. Ask him to remove anything that is holding the thing that you've asked that you've asked of him. And in the process, also forgive yourself if you feel like there's something that you did to contribute to your current state. And, you know, once you ask for forgiveness, just continue living your life until that thing actually manifests in the physical. Because, like I said, it took it took a little time, but it did manifest eventually. One of the problems that we have is that we'll ask for something to be done and if it's not done within the time frame that we feel like it should be done or if we get tired of praying and believing and asking for it then we feel like okay well i'm just going to give up if it hasn't happened now then it's never going to happen and that's a big mistake you have to keep believing no matter how long it may seem like it's taken for that thing to come to pass so you know that's the message for today believe for the best and most importantly you have to expect it so that's all i have for y'all i pray that this blessed you talk to you later okay bye